Hello and welcome to the CS Card video tutorial. My name is Alex and today I'll make an overview of design features in CS Card. Let's begin. You can find all design features in CS Card in the design section of the admin panel. Themes, layouts, templates, email templates, documents, menus and product tabs. I'll omit email templates and documents in this video, so let's turn to themes. In the Themes section you can choose, install, upload, delete and customize themes and styles for your store. The page is divided into three parts – current theme at the top, installed and available themes below, and general information to the right. In the current theme part you can choose styles available for the current theme, use the theme editor to customize your storefront in real time, and edit content on site. The theme editor allows you to create your own unique style for a storefront with just a few clicks. Content editing is used to change the names of interface elements, products and pages on the go. The tabs below are used to switch between themes and styles. Each theme, as you have already noticed, can have several styles. Styles can drastically change the look of your storefront with just one click. After that you can still proceed with your own customization. In the Browse all available themes tab there is a list of themes available for the installation. To the right of the page you can see the general information about the current theme. There is the theme name, directory where the theme is placed, the number of layouts and styles and the current theme developer. Now let's turn to layouts. Layouts determine the structure of your storefront. A layout consists of layout pages which represent various page types of your storefront. Layout pages consist of blocks nested inside containers. Changes you make on a layout page will affect the page on the storefront. A block contains a certain piece of information like logo, product details, breadcrumbs and so on. You can add, edit, remove or simply move blocks to change the structure of the page. The next important thing in the design section is templates. With templates, you can edit the source code of the theme directly from the admin panel. We do not recommend to change anything here if you don't have enough experience in design or development. But experienced developers can make an eye candy using this tool. Moving on. Menus help to organize different types of content displayed on pages into short consistent lists. A good example here is the Quick Links menu. A list of useful links gathered at one place. After creating a menu, just place it into a block to make it viable. The Product Tabs section is the last one for today. Product Tabs organize the information about a product on a product detailed page. Use them to split product descriptions, features, reviews and other items into separated groups. This way product pages will look much more clean and decent. Well, that was a quick look into CS Card design features. If you have any questions, you can ask them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next CS Card video tutorials.